The journey to achieve your dreams. Have you ever found yourself wondering why, despite all your efforts, your deepest dreams and desires seem to always be just out of reach? Perhaps you feel that no matter how hard you try, there's always something missing for you to truly achieve what you aspire to. If this resonates with you, know that you're not alone on this journey. Many people share the feeling of being stuck in an endless cycle of attempts and failures, never truly seeing their dreams come to fruition. But what if I told you there's a powerful key, a tool that can completely transform your reality, and that tool is your own words. The transformative power of words. Words are much more than mere sounds or letters on a page. They are the living expression of our innermost thoughts and deepest beliefs. They have the incredible power to shape our reality, influencing our thoughts, actions, and ultimately, the course of our lives. When we begin to understand and harness the intrinsic power of words, we open doors to unprecedented transformation. By choosing words that radiate positivity, strength, and power, we start reprogramming our subconscious mind, paving the way for success, happiness, and fulfillment. The Law of Assumption and its impact on the subconscious Neville Goddard, an influential metaphysical thinker, teaches us about the Law of Assumption. According to him, our spoken words are a direct reflection of our subconscious assumptions. Throughout the day, we express these assumptions through our words, and if we observe closely, we'll see how they perfectly manifest in our world. For example, if we spend the day lamenting and talking about our limitations, we are, in fact, reinforcing those very barriers in our subconscious mind. The subconscious, by its nature, doesn't distinguish between what's beneficial or detrimental to us. It simply works to manifest what we believe and consider true. So, our words, loaded with emotion and belief, become the reality we live in, turning words into reality. Now you may wonder, why, even though I verbally express my desire to be happy, do I continue to face unhappiness? The answer, according to Goddard, is surprisingly simple, yet profoundly revealing. You only manifest what you are, not what you want. This means that our manifestations are a direct reflection of our underlying identity and beliefs, not just the words we speak. So, instead of saying, I want to be happy, how about affirming, I am blessed, happy, and feel wonderful? By making this shift, you're declaring your identity and desired state of happiness rather than focusing on the absence of what you desire. If you want to reprogram your subconscious mind to attract success and financial abundance more quickly and effectively, I've left a video below into the comments with an extremely powerful technique. Continuing, it's important to have coherence between words and feelings, but it's not enough to just speak words of abundance and wealth. It's crucial that these words are accompanied by genuine feelings of gratitude and a state of abundance. When you truly feel and emotionally connect with your words of abundance, when you live in gratitude for what you already have and immerse yourself in a state of abundance, you'll notice a significant shift in your speech. You'll naturally move away from complaints and lean more towards expressing gratitude and positivity. This internal change is reflected in your words and your attitude towards life. Words are like seeds of reality. Our loving words and thoughts function as seeds planted in our subconscious mind. Over time, these seeds germinate and transform into the reality we desire. It's crucial to remember that our words never return empty. They have the power to shape our experience and the reality we create. By observing the conversations of people around us, we can clearly see how their words manifest in their everyday realities. Those who constantly talk about poverty and limitations tend to experience more of those circumstances. On the other hand, those who speak about money, success, and expansion often experience greater abundance and prosperity in their lives. The Immortal Power of Words A Mystical Perspective Hermes Trismegistus, a legendary figure in the occult tradition, reminds us that man has been gifted with the ability to speak and think, making him akin to the immortals. Our words, therefore, are immortal and remain in the ether as eternal testimonies of our thoughts and intentions. They are like magical spells with lasting impacts that transcend time and space. Trismegistus also teaches us that the right use of the word will lead us to the realm of the gods in the afterlife, suggesting that our words and thoughts have an influence that goes beyond our physical existence. We must, therefore, be extremely conscious of how we use our words and thoughts, as they have the potential to bring both blessings and disasters, impacting not only our personal reality, but the collective one as well. Awakening the Immortal Within Us By becoming aware of our words and thoughts and using them to create a more positive and beneficial reality, we are awakening the immortal being within us. If we speak negatively about the world or our personal circumstances, we are only exacerbating the situation. 
Therefore, it's essential to choose our words wisely and use them to welcome long-term benefits. When we speak about love, we start to see love reflected everywhere because our words and thoughts create our reality. Similarly, if we speak about hate, unfortunately, that's what we'll find in this world. Our words have the power to influence our experience and shape the reality around us. Conclusion, creating a better world with our words. Understanding that this world is a reflection of who we are internally is crucial. The kingdom of heaven is not in an external place, but within us. Likewise, hell is not a physical place, but a mental state we create with our negative attitudes and thoughts. As immortal beings, we have the ability to imagine and manifest everything we desire. By elevating our consciousness and understanding the deeper reality that already sleeps within us, we can create a kingdom of heaven for ourselves and others. Therefore, it's crucial to speak our magical words of conviction and confidence. By doing so, we'll be manifesting heaven on earth, transforming our reality and that of others. Don't forget to share this knowledge, like, and leave a comment. Remember that if you want to reprogram your mind with a powerful technique to attract success and prosperity, I've left a video below in the comments. Subscribe and activate notifications for more content like this. Together, we can transform our lives and the world around us. Thank you for watching, and until next time,